So this is the brush I use guys. The link will be in the description. I got it from Amazon. It's a size zero. And this is what I use. It's a black cap. It makes the pollen easy to see. It's from my Ninja Blender. The white stuff you're seeing is the anthers. That's the male reproductive part of the flower, not the pollen. So here I'm separating the pollen and the anthers and just discarding the anthers. As you can see, the pollen is easy to see. This is the male flower. The petals are more spread apart versus the female. So you just gently brush the middle to brush the anthers and the pollen from the flower. And then later I just throw away the male flower because I know it's not pollinated. You want to brush a good bit of pollen on the tip of the brush. You're going to be pollinating the stigma, the middle part of the flower. I just use my thumb and my index finger just to spread two petals and just brush the middle. And then I squeeze the petal together just to extract the pollen from the brush and then break off one of the petal so I know it's pollinated. The female flower will turn to a male flower stage. As you can see, this is the female flower we pollinated. As you can see, one of the petal was broken off. So after it turns to a male stage, we just gather the pollen from it. And I just pluck off another petal so I know that I collected pollen. This was from last year. There was just too many, I had to thin out some fruits. Hemp pollination works guys. Enjoy.